I'm Marissa Mark Antonio, and you're watching Editor TV. We are here at Arkevia Books to toast Peter Penoyer and his new book, featuring some of the most beautiful architecture by a classicist who also has that modern traditional take. Let's go find out what Peter has to say and check in with some of the guests here tonight. Why a book and why now? Well, you know, after 20 years of seeing all my talented partners and associates slaving away on these beautiful projects, I knew we had to do something to uh, show the variety of our work, and, and we, we had fun doing it. I mean, since he was a little boy, and you know, he just, he's a wonderful architect. His, his parents were good friends of mine, and uh, I introduced him to Bob Stern, who was his mentor, and who wrote the introduction for the book. I brought Bob to Peter's parents' townhouse, which they were thinking of renovating it, and Bob pronounced it the least sexy house he'd ever seen in New York. You were able to study with Robert Stern and then also work with him. Yeah, well, I begged him for a job before I went to architecture school, so I started at a slide table without a chair. He said, we have a job for you, but we don't have a seat. Is it true that you were once a modernist? Of course I was. I grew up in New York. I grew up on 65th Street. I used to, you know, relish every SOM building and read all the books about Le Corbusier, and I made my pilgrimage to Marseille, but I got over it. What's the big architectural debate between you two as a modernist and a classicist face off? Well, I think, you know, similar to Edwin Lutyens and other great architects of their era, Peter is a modernist within a classical lexicon. He's a true professional in, in the sense of kind of a classical Renaissance architect and I admire him greatly for it. I've worked with Peter on six projects today, and I think we still have a few really great projects uh, to go. He's a decorator's dream architect. You know, he worked uh, intimately with interior designers and decorators. You think of Jefferson working as an architect and as a decorator and as, an, as sort of an enthusiast and an intellectual. We have exactly the same relationship. Peter, I think, is the outstanding classical architect in New York. And I have his, his first book and was so happy to come tonight to buy the second one. Do you make buildings at home? I do. That's right. What kind of buildings? And, Houses? and sometimes it falls down. Sometimes it falls down. Not, not Peter Penoyer's building. No, only my building. Thank you for watching Editor TV and joining us at Peter Penoyer's book launch at Arkevia Books. I'm Marissa Marcantonio for Editor TV, and have a great night.